This case consider the issue of indefeasibility of title and whether or not the owner of a property whose name had been replaced with that of a fictitious person through fraudulent means could restore her registered title free of a mortgage which had been secured against the property and also entered on the register. In this case a woman owned land and gave her solicitor the certificates of title and a power of attorney outlining that her husband had the power to sell, mortgage or dispose of the land. The solicitor later forged a transfer of the land to a fictitious person and with the documents was able to remove the woman's name from the register and replace it with the fictitious person's name. The solicitor then arranged a mortgage over the property and the solicitor used the money for his own purposes. The mortgagee was then unable to register the mortgage because the registrar needed evidence relating to this fictitious person. The solicitor then forged even more documents and the mortgage was subsequently registered. The woman discovered the fraud and she brought an action against the mortgagee, the fictitious person and the solicitor. She sought to have the title returned to her and to have the mortgage removed from the folio. She argued that the mortgage was on a non-existent interest and was therefore worthless. The central issue for the court, however, was whether or not the woman could retain her title free of the mortgage, which was against the property. The court ultimately held